Justice and peace to each and every one of you. This is your servant, other man, God, the world's top cop with news uncut. As you see, this is a child with a cigarette in her hands. And already at the age where she stands is a professional smoker. And this child has a mother and not knowing whether or not the father is present. Nonetheless, someone is raising this child. And this child's future, as we look at her, is dim. And is troubling. And if her actions is not corrected by the one who brought her into the world to guide her not to become a cigarette smoker, not to make decisions on her own as a child, giving her the right to smoke, which will later lead to the right to smoke marijuana, which will lead to cocaine or crack cocaine, which will lead to ecstasy and other drugs that will lead to alcoholism, drug abuse that will lead to burglarizing someone's home or bringing into someone's car that will lead to stealing if she's not already stealing and committing theft that will lead to her murdering, killing someone that will lead to this child growing up into the juvenile system and from the juvenile system being handcuffed put in prison that will lead to her getting out of jail going back into the jail system all because of her mother that could be or has been in jail because of her father that may be already in jail or not in her life now that is leading to the forecast of this child's future. To not have a chance to experience what it is like to be a child the correct way. And if she is not corrected as a child, Someone in the dark world, in the streets, is going to grab a hold of this child. And this child may be a future prostitute that will lead her in jail. This child will be molested and abused as a child when the mother has no care for the child and the concerns of this child's welfare and the dominant the society and the powers that be knows of this child's being neglected in this manner is waiting to put her in the system and the police officers will have no choice but to intervene when the call comes and put her in handcuffs and put her in jail and her life may end up in jail or before jail or after the jail sentence will die and will meet her maker the God of this life that we all shall meet and there will be no excuse and I pray for this child I pray that there be no handcuffs be put on that child I pray that someone in that child's family or will be in her life will remove her from the mind and condition and state that she's presently in and if not I pray someone gives her information to CPIIA and help her in her progress as we 
are here to develop her, not to go in the direction to be a convict, to be a inmate, to have a jail number being read to her, given to her, that her future can be changed around. And we are present with CPIIA, Citizens and Police Immediate Interactive Assistance that can direct a child and give her help and mentorship the right way with police officers in her area that have programs to help her and systems in place in the communities to redirect her not to be a criminal but a productive citizen in society as she grows older before it becomes too late and she reaches a, a age and a mindset of no return. Over out.